What is going on guys? Welcome back. More Madden 18 commentary. Do me a favor, take a moment, hit the like button, subscribe button, criticism in the comment section, Twitter, shutdown safety is my username. Playing this for you at speed, I found a little bit of a glitch in this game, and I know the cause of and solution to it, but I digress. We'll walk through this together and take a look at what happens. So, first of all, you see the way this play action works. In my opinion, the halfback would be okay where he is based on the dropback, but here's the problem with the delayed blitz. Take a look at where my linemen are, but take a look at how it happens. So, when you see this delayed blitz, which is really nice, you know, he backs up initially, then he goes to blitz, pulls back, and now... He's going to actually follow through. But the problem is, while all that happened, you can see these linemen continue to back up to the point one of them actually gets behind, the lineman actually gets back behind the quarterback. Now, I've got a tight end here who can block as well, but they're in such a close proximity to each other, and they're so far back that they're really not able to do anything. And this, this has happened to me six or seven times, so I know it's continual. This one may be the worst case and another aspect of the play I want to talk about. So you can see I'm able to throw this ball directly in the face of pressure, which I should not be able to. I mean, just look at my posture here as I release this pass. I mean, this should not have been followed through successfully and clean to go down the field. Now, the other aspect of this play I wanted to talk about is actually the coverage here. So we're going to back up just a bit. We're going to talk about procedural awareness. Take a look at the safety here. Comes over, plays his own. Procedurally, he is looking at Mike Wallace. And I like this. I like the fact right now he's looking at the quarterback, but you can back up. You can watch the head tracking. This is something that we've wanted to see in video games for a very long time. Staring at the quarterback, staring at the receiver. Now, you have to take this AI and functionally put it on the field. So, if he knows there's nothing else to the left, what is he cutting back for? This is an open receiver in any form of football. The ball has been released. To go back and just watch it from the ball's perspective, watch this coverage reaction. Why is he not doing anything other than following or trying to, to bracket Mike Wallace? What is he doing putting himself in this situation? And for what it's worth, you know, the hand fighting in this game is actually really good off the line. I don't know if this would be a tackle in real life with Mike Wallace, but I just don't understand the way this picking up those delayed blitzers works, and I really don't know why we still have these zone coverage issues. Would love to know your guys' opinions on this.